Hello and welcome to episode 5 of the Dream World Tribal Run. Let's go. It's been a moment since I played, so we'll have to remember. And remind us what we're actually doing here and there. That's fine. We'll, we'll just figure it out as we go, I guess. Let's see. This is the other person. Lots of animal food, which is awesome. And we made uh, some defenses last time as well. There's a bunch of animals we wanted to tame. Uh, I think. Ooh. That's a lot of animals. I was also thinking about these uh, guys here. We could uh, wall them off for winter, put some lights in there, and do at least some growing during the winter time. In there. We'll see. We'll see. Maybe it's just better to get a ton of animals and oh, pemmican and hope uh, we have enough to survive the winter and just eat them. Or something like that. Maybe it isn't still low. Hopefully, this, uh, this grows soon. It's, it's actually five minutes. Yeah, well, well, five is okay. You know, I should probably actually store the hay somewhere else and let the animals just eat the grass outside. Hmm. Yeah, we'll all have to plan a, a storage building for the hay. Guess uh, down here? Not sure. Also, uh, hmm. a storage building for all this. This garbage here would be nice as well. Uh, what are you cooking, by the way? You're cooking simple meals and pemmican. Okay. That's what you should do. This pemmican will survive a year, so we should have a we should have some food. How much pemmican? Seven hundred and something. Yeah, that's pretty okay. And these will be eaten as we go. We need a bit more uh, stuff to process in the meat. <laughs> I guess there, there is, there is, there is meat there. Also looks like uh, my uh, stone stuff is down. Ooh, shit! Man, ooh, pack of man hunting elephants. Oh shit! Oh, it's only one. Thank God. You know, punching an elephant is probably not the greatest idea. Let's see how much uh, damage the traps do. Set up a defensive line here. You go there. We need more bows. More great bows would be quite handy. Shit. Attack! We are so screwed. Shade Blade got one hit from the elephant and that's it. <laughs> Just a scratch. The torso. It's bleeding. We got the elephant, so that's awesome. And the elephant tusks. That's a lot of meat. Someone needs to go rearm the traps as well. Those traps actually were quite handy. Slowing down at least uh, the elephant. Can you uh, treat him? Angry, angry elephants. Uh, did we get the stone cutting table yet? As butchering, sculptor. We did not. Let's get the. Oh, we don't have stone cutting yet. Are we researching that? Yeah. 
that may be the reason. Thank God it was only one elephant. If it had been uh, like several elephants, we'd be so dead now. Six years left on the planet killer and one season. I don't think this colony will survive six years anyways. I fear uh, some attacks at some point will, will probably wipe us out, if I have to guess. Camels on the loose. Everyone is getting pregnant. Awesome. Let's see. Uh, dogs are still being trained. Toot City Cat is also alive. I'm a bit worried uh, that since I don't have an area blocked for the animals, uh, some predator might come and attack them, especially the small animals, the turkeys and stuff. So we should maybe wall off like uh, this area here and put the animals in there. Here maybe. Yeah, let's uh, let's do that. Do I want it here or there? Ah, let's just put it down down here. Sounds fine. Fine to me. We'll use this as a natural wall all the way there, and then go down from here. And a couple wooden doors. And also, uh, let's make a storage building for the pemmican and not the pemmican, the animal feed. Yeah. This hut will serve as a. The animal food uh, storage and uh, let's make a, another building here, like that. That's uh, gonna be the sleeping spot for the animals. If you're hearing some rumbling in the background, there's a small thunderstorm going on. Apparently, the strongest uh, <laughs> this summer. So, that's the noise you hear in the background if you're hearing some rumbling. Hey, new muffalo. We also need to uh, make a no roof area here. Can we clear it from this this house? No. Nah. Uh, well. yeah. All right. Uh, are we out of wood? Yes, we are. Let's go chop down uh, some trees. Elephant tusks, we can sell those. I guess I could use this uh, for some uh, other storage when the animals are moved here. We also need to uh, fireproof this area. It's very, very not fireproof at the moment. I'm thinking uh, at least the uh, outside walls, let's make a, well, eventually when we get stone cutting we'll expand uh, and make the walls out of stone, but I think for now we should uh, just uh, pave it with a 
too thick a too tall thick a layer of uh, wood, so um, it prevents the fire from spreading. Floors floors don't burn currently, thankfully. So let's just uh, queue up that as well. Can replace that with a uh, stone or something later on, but for now, just a safety measure. Because there's bound to be fires and stuff uh, outside uh, that could burn, burn this. It's gonna require quite a bit of wood, though. A couple thousand, I guess. Oh well. Means we have to chop down a forest and a half. No. Ah, this one. No. That should do it. Technically, I should probably, probably do it on the other side as well. So, if we get the lightning strike in this side, uh, it doesn't spread. Because literally everything is made of made of wood, which will cause happy times when uh, we get a really nice fire going on. I mean, we could pop all some of these open and steal the stone as well. We should probably deconstruct everything on the map. Get these buildings. Set the engine danger. We got a bunch of these already, so that's okay. Oh, Grizzly Bear Revenge. Oh, Milford, you're so done. If if only you can get through the door. Go, 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 Milford. Oh, thank God. Uh, help. That taming didn't go too well. How bad did Milford get wounded? Ah, uh, just a bit of bleeding. Not too bad. We'll have to eat the... Eat the thing. We also need to get the clothes making. So we're gonna make some nice... Uh, polar bear. Oh, sorry, grizzly bear. Hats and stuff. For the winter. Damn, this bear is taking lots of hits from uh, from your glob. Alright, that's dead. This is the only thing we cannot break, right? I hope, uh, no, I don't think these are, uh, these shouldn't have anything in there, right? Let's do a small for our engine danger. Well, I guess we'll know in a second. 
something like mecha nuts would be so fun. Okay, that's nothing. Should be enough. Is no one uh, arming the traps? Wonder what. Oh, do I need to? Oh, I need to. Tell them to rearm. Auto rearm, yes. Yeah, that's gonna help. Nice. Let's get the complex clothing next, because I would like to get some uh, clothes on for these guys. So now we can make uh, the stone cutter stable. In there. So we can uh, start making some st proper stone stuff. Make our tribal colony a bit more fireproof. I'm still gonna use the trees uh, for this, because uh, cutting the stone is gonna take forever. Thousand two hundred pemmican now. That's very very nice. That's silver ore. Too bad we cannot mine. I I really like the limitation of not being able to mine though. It it kind of forces you to play the game a lot differently. So you cannot rely on mining, and you have to just live with the existing landscape you have. This works uh, actually surprisingly well. But they uh, arm them uh, from the side as well. I like that. I may have to try those that design uh, more often. One thing that's, um, that I'm really, really worried about is sappers with molotovs, because uh, once they get hit a couple times with those traps, I think they're gonna try going through the walls and a couple molotovs into the wooden walls pretty much will burn down the whole damn thing. That's a bit scary. Is there any other animals we could have tame? We should also sell the animals. Some of the animals. Just trade them like all of all of these. Just uh, tame them and sell them. No, seems like we have a. Everything we need. Pretty much queued. We're also getting a lot of uh, a lot of cloth, which means when we get the cloth uh, clothing making, we can um, start making cloth. Also, we could get carpet making, make some carpets to make people happier with their houses, which is not totally bad idea. It's actually a pretty good idea. Please, Milford, don't enrage more, th more things. That's Jade. And a turkey. More Jade. Huh. Of course, uh, there's a ton of Jade on the map where we're gonna dig. Was this also engine danger? I'm not gonna touch it. Too risky. Uh, no. Don't, don't tame the squirrel. Squirrels are for eating, not for taming. 
Shangri-La, the bug. Nice. And you've, you've bonded with that? Damn it. Now it's uh, difficult to sell it. I'm still probably gonna sell it. Animal area. Yeah, we should probably expand out that here as well. Give an extension there for now. I should do actually two animal areas. Like give them a grazing area. This animal animal one. They can just graze around the base. And then uh, let's do uh, manage areas. New animal area. And this is the go inside when an attack comes area we can just switch the map in there or if we start losing too much animals for some reason such as wild animals trying to eat them and the turkey we have a good amount of turkeys now which is great Some turkey dinners ready for the winter. I'm gonna keep the slate wall, I guess. Or, I don't know. Let's actually tear it down. Can use this for building trambos. Oof. 2.5 chance. Bungie tamed muffalo. Nice. Who is our uh, highest tamer? Babarix? Taming trambo. Good luck! Get some cargo pods as well. Ooh, nice. If that actually gets angry, that's the end of our colony though. 2.5% chance. Yeah, it's five times higher chance for the tame to fail than succeed. <laughs> Oof. And bow chances are pretty low. Well, there's no way we are killing this Trambo though. Even if I really want. Too bad uh, the starving tactic was nerfed, so you cannot you know just uh, build a. Just gracefully walks all the traps, uh, through all the traps as well. So, previously, when a uh, Trambo uh, just walked walk around and fell asleep during the night. You could actually just build a wall around them and let them starve inside the building because they won't never break the walls, but now that they do. So, build a wall around it. But that tactic was nerfed because, well, it was a bit, bit cheaty, to be honest. But so, so nice. I guess. <laughs> No raids, which is nice, for sure. Is the table not done? We like steel. No, no, we do have steel. Could someone uh, focus on this? Like you? So I'd love to get some stone cutting uh, going. Let's do... Not forever. Until we have like... 750 stone stuff. Do we have anyone who is uh, crafting? Yeah, we have a uh, Defi. Although he's building as well. Well, someone, uh, one of you three guys can work on this. It's probably gonna be actually uh, Tuki who's gonna make those. Well, whoever, whoever feels like doing that. 
What's her keys? Milford is on on fire on the tra taming. I guess all my builders are currently just deconstructing all this all over the place. Oh well, let's just let them uh, finish that before we do anything else. It's almost the end of summer. Bit scary thought. It's winter. This coming for sure. I don't know how harsh the winter is gonna be, but it's probably gonna be <laughs> pretty harsh. We might have to change our housing design for the winter as well. Warming these up is gonna be a pain in the ass. Also, we need to stockpile wood. For the winter. Because we need to, get to keep the fires and torches going. And if there's a ton of snow, it's gonna be really annoying to do anything. Well, we get some nice traders soon, uh, with some nice things for us to trade. I normally don't really care about the uh, uh, tribal traders, but uh, when I'm playing tribals and I'm not using guns, I really wish we get a, a tribal trader with uh, great bows. More great bows would be so nice to have. What is my Dimper Wolf eating, by the way? Raw meat, corpses, meals, and kibble. More turkey. That is these, uh, some some animals, I have to say. Holy crap. 20% chance, quite high chance already. For that. Can haul. Oh! Oh no, they're, they're still being trained. Yes, I was like... Huh? No, it's, it's still, still... In the progress. Hey, storage building should be here. Or, alternatively, we could do this. Which actually is not a bad idea. Yep. We'll just expand, uh, expand uh, our longhouse. Build a storage room there, put the food in this area. I like that. Milk spoils in one season when outside. Huh. Who knew? I can put all this pemmican and uh, all this other food junk into that area with that. So I think uh, here is a good uh, point to stop again in this episode. So thank you for watching this uh, episode of Rimbird. Tribal Let's Play, and if you like this one, check out the other Let's Plays reviews content on the YouTube channel, and check out the live stream on Naruto TV, where we play this game and many others every day. And I'll see you guys next time. So bye bye.